Okay, guys, I am back because I wanted to add on to that pantry moth infestation video that was just posted because I wanted to show you guys a demonstration of what a larva or uh, egg infestation may look like in your cabinets. And this is uh, some onion salt. I've had it for a while, but this is what it looks like. So you'll open your spices or your grains and you'll see clumps. Clumps that don't break when you shake them. These are the webbing or like the silk thread that the larva has when it's uh, metamorphosizing in your food. And this is the food source that it uses. So this is what it looks like. And then the process, I don't know if you can see this, but this is some Old Bay seasoning that we use on the regular and there is moths in it and do you see how the obey is sticking to the sides well that's not supposed to happen right so we know that the larva was here and it hatched here and it's got lumps and it's got clumps that don't break upon shaking you can see that and then the bottom of it has like this wet so if your seasoning looks wet or sticking to the bottom um, of the container, these, this actually has live, I mean, uh, dead moths in it. That little brown thing you see right there, that is a moth, a pantry moth. So, yeah, I just wanted to show you what it could look like in your cupboard. This is what it looks like. It should not, your seasoning or your spices should not stick to the end, nor should they have clumps that don't break up with a shake or don't move like I had um, one of those really big jars of lemon pepper that you get from like Sam's Club and it was soaking wet and full of knots so clumps that would not move that in the lemon pepper itself was just stagnant and stable and it's a powder so it shouldn't move nor should it accumulate uh, unbreakable clumps or clumps that would be hard to break. Uh, this is all larva of the infestation. So thank you guys. I just wanted to show you what that would look like in case you were wondering what a moth infestation looks like and what it can do to your cupboard.